Well, it is St. Patrick's Day and a lot of festivities underway in the city. This year, though, looking a lot different compared to previous years. Star Bodie joins us now live outside of Molly Brannigan's on State Street. Hello, Star. Hi, Dave. Top of the afternoon to you. Yeah, well, St. Patrick's Day is well underway here along State Street, and things are looking a lot different this year after Molly Brannigan's being closed last year because of the pandemic. Now, last year at this time, the restaurants were closed. Now they're doing what they can to make sure everyone is being safe and practicing social distancing. Tables are six feet apart, and extra sanitization is being used. Another town favorite, Sullivan's, is reopened for just the holiday today. Owners tell us they want to celebrate the oldest pub and allow people to stop by and have green beer, eggs and ham and Guinness. Now here's what uh, some have to say about being able to finally celebrate the holiday and enjoying the nice weather. I am so excited. I'm so tired of being cooped up. So this is nice. We celebrate every year. So it's nice to actually be out and celebrating. Yeah, talk about what you're going to be doing. Now, these bars and restaurants we spoke to this morning tell us that if they do reach capacity, they're going to ask people to stand outside in a line so they can allow for social distancing inside. And Dave, I have to tell you, with the weather being nice outside, the sun is shining, you really can't be waiting long and be able to wait with that nice weather. We'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, it's a win-win for everyone, even if you aren't waiting outside. Thank you, Star Bodie, reporting live this afternoon.